Hey, what's up guys? Jake here with Success Motors, man. I got an exciting one for you all today. A little different, a little different. This is my first time, I believe, well, it's my second time doing one of these walk around videos with a vehicle other than a Ford Excursion. So I'm gonna do a little bit different, a little bit different flow. Man, if you're just landing on the channel, again, my name is Jake. I'm the owner operator of Success Motors. We're a specialty dealership down in College Station, Texas. A couple of things I'll say right off the bat as a big loud truck drives by me right now is I am, um, not doing any editing on these films i'm a one one take jake uh, so i just say one take here uh, my goal is to not have any kind of massive distractions but even if there are i'm not gonna edit this video because i want you guys to see the car there's no filters there's nothing like that i'm just showing you a raw video unedited this is the car that we have for you uh today anyway i film these videos because we sell a lot of cars up north and I want you to feel confident and comfortable in what you're buying, with what you're buying to um, not need to come down here unless you absolutely want to come down here. Because I get it, there's certain people that wouldn't buy things without seeing them and, and actually driving and, and stuff like that. But my goal is the next 10 to 15 minutes to show you every single thing about this car, good and bad, so that you know everything about it. And yeah, basically you can make an informed decision. So anyway, you guys, this is a 1999 Pontiac Firebird Trans Am WS6 Performance Package with 47,000 original miles, no accident history, maintained flawlessly, clearly garage kept. Guys, beautiful, beautiful car. I've actually filmed a few other videos uh, involving this car. Check them out on the YouTube channel. There's a couple like be behind the scenes videos. Definitely encourage you to check those out if you're interested in it. If I were buying a car, I'd want to watch everything I could before buying it. So I'd encourage you to do that. But man, I'm gonna just kind of get into it and deep dive this car as much as I can and everything that I know about it. So again, it's a, it's a clean title, clean Carfax, no accidents. This car looks to be, uh, to have been garage kept. Yes, the paint looks that good. There are very few imperfections on this car. So this video won't take long, but I'll walk you around it. These are the original wheels, WS6. It's got some BF Gold Ridge G4 Sport tires on them. All, all around, they're brand, uh, brand new looking. I didn't replace them, but these tires look brand new. Looks like they're 275 40 ZR17s. Passenger side trans am i don't know about you guys but man i really love these cars i was only nine years old when this car came out but i just remember as a kid loving these cars just beautiful i'll show you the inside of course we'll start it i'll show you under the hood too that beautiful ls motor i don't see a single scratch there's no dents on this car guys no dents you can hold me to it no dents i don't see a single scratch on the on on that side here or that door Rear quarter panel, the story is the same. I don't see a single scratch. Maybe there was a scratch there at some point that somebody has fixed. Again, tires are brand new looking. Guys, this car runs, idles, shifts, stops. Just superb. Couple of little, I would call that a bubble in the clear in the clear coat couple little bubbles in the clear coat right there on that bar whatever you would call that this one does have the t-tops it is an automatic again ws6 performance package look these i always thought these like these rear brake lights looked like uh dragonfly eyes i just love them dual exhaust guys no dents no dings very few flaws. And at the end of the day, it's still a 24 year old vehicle with 47,000 miles. So don't be unrealistic. You know, it's been driven. It, it has a few little bitty like scuffs and things, but I would rate this all things considered very highly. I've spent a few days with it. I've driven it a little bit and I really like this car y'all. It's right, it's tight, it drives good, it stops great, it shifts good. Yeah, it's bone stock, by the way, which I think is cool. Nobody's ever done anything to it. So I would say it's safer to assume it hasn't been hot rodded or streeted or anything like that. No dents, no dings, no door dings. Just absolutely superb. Windshield is factory, I believe. No cracks in it. It's got the T-tops coming around here. 
this incredible. Forgive the glare, but those nostrils, that's what it's all about. These Trans Ams, absolutely beautiful. Does have a little clear coat issue right here. I bet somebody was buffing it. I bet what happened is somebody was buffing it and they got a little too aggressive right there. I, I would be willing to bet that's what they did. They burned through it because there's nothing else on the rest of this hood. So that kind of is an interesting boo-boo. And my assumption is somebody was buffing it and messed it up. Could be wrong, but that is my viewpoint. Let's check out under the hood real quick. We'll definitely, well, let's go inside. Let's go inside. This thing's so much smaller than those excursions. I don't know what to do with these videos. We're going away faster. Man, just, it's got a lot of features for being a 99. You know, power seats and these seats are immaculate. Rear seats. It's got a lot of like little features, little button for the trunk. Oh, it worked. Cool, I'll pop the hood while we're down here. Check it out. I'll start it up in a minute. Just beautiful, guys. Open that puppy up. Everything is bone stock, factory, T-tops. Let's see here how to open this. Oh, it's already, the button worked perfect. <clears throat> so this guy opened up. I think this is a cool feature of these cars of this generation. You can put stuff there, you know, like a suitcase or a bag of groceries. It's got this cat. I guess that's where your spare would probably go. It's not there. And then I guess that's a, I guess that's, a tw oh, it's a 12 disc CD changer. Come on. You can listen to your tunes all day. 12 disc CD changer. Is there a cooler logo than that? I don't think so. Go to the other side here. The story's the same, guys. It's a brand new car. There's no flaws here. And it runs as good as it looks. There's no flaws in this car, guys. That's a dragonfly. Just, just flew in there. That's shocking. I haven't opened this yet. Oh, look at this. This is, we're doing this together. I haven't opened this. Oh, it's like a leather bound manual. Oh man, it's the original. Sorry, with the camera called here, it's the original owner's manual. What else is in here? I'm gonna set the phone down, forgive this guys. I just haven't done it yet. All right, but I'll keep talking. I don't know where to put the phone. I'm just gonna set it down right there. I'm looking for the original window sticker and I need both hands. I'll let you know if I find it. Ah, oh, bummer. I didn't find it. Sorry, I'm back. Didn't find it. That would have been cool. Really cool, guys. If you're in the market for a Trans Am, this is a good one. Open the hood. Check out this LS motor. Of course, you got the functional Ram Air with this car. It's all stock. I think a lot of these cars were probably modified, used, and abused. This one was not. Just clean. Clean doesn't leak anything. It's been sitting on our warehouse floor for a couple of the days, maybe about a week, and nothing leaking underneath it. You do have your original keys with key fob, kind of cool. They pop in it. I'm gonna start it. Again, you guys, Success Motors. You can email me info at successmotors.net or call me 979-202-1948. If this car tickles your fancy, it starts right up. Now the doors are open, hood's open, and the rear trunk lid's open, so that's the reason for some lights. See here, 47,844 miles. Just amazing, let's see, air is blowing. Hopefully you hear it, air is blowing cold. Radio works great. Everything works, guys. I'm telling you, every single thing works. Doors open here, but window going down. Window going down. Locks work. It all works. I mean, just, just awesome. Let me get under the hood here so you can hear it run and idle. Absolutely perfect, guys. 
this is a beautiful car. Let me let you hear the exhaust. Incredible. Y'all, if it was my car, if it was my car, I would I would add a aftermarket exhaust because it's a little quiet from the factory. Now, there's obviously, from a collector perspective, you want to leave it as stock as possible, so I would definitely not throw away the stock exhaust, maybe it can be returned to it, uh, but for my car, I would throw on a loud set of pipes and make this thing loud, um, but man, as it is, beautiful car, guys, beautiful car, if you have any questions, email me, call me, definitely be sure to follow us on Instagram, success underscore motors, I post vehicles there as incoming before anywhere else, uh, this is a, just, a, again, a beautiful 99 Trans Am. WS6, 47,000 miles, clean title, no accident history, hard pressed to find any flaws other than just the slightest scuffs in the paint. I don't think we found a single dent. And we only saw one little clear coat issue on the hood, which again, I think that's from somebody uh, buffing it too aggressively. It's got the brand new tires on it. I think you could pick this car up and drive it. Pick it up and drive it, just like it is. Anyway guys, if you have any other questions, feel free to let me know. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe to the video if you wouldn't mind. It does help. And if you have any uh, interest in buying a Ford Excursion, check out some of the other videos. We've got four excursions listed right now. We've got a Cobra coming up that we're going to be listing hopefully this week, as well as three other excursions. So we're keeping them coming. And, uh, yeah, otherwise, God bless you guys, and we'll talk soon.